left side, midway back. Louis Satzman, Raptors Republic. Pascal, the last few rounds, there was incredible length on the floor on you and uh, as help defenders. Did it feel like there was more breathing room in the, spa in the paint for you tonight? Um, I don't know. I, I'm not really able to tell, but I think for me, it's just in transition, um, kind of kind of running and, and whatever basket I can get, easy baskets at the rim, I try to do that. Um, so yeah, to, to answer your question, I don't, I don't really know like if it was a difference, but for me, it was just you know taking whatever the defense gives me. Left side, Rash. Pascal Arash Medeni with Sportsnet. Warriors come in. They've been through the finals before. There are some people wondering how would the Raptors handle the stage? How, how would they handle the moment? How do you think you guys responded tonight? Um, I think we did you know pretty pretty good job um, at home. I mean the fans was amazing, man. I just want to say that um, from from. Coming out, you know, for warm up to to the, to the end of the game, the just the support and, and you know going crazy. Um, I never seen anything like that. Um, just you know, just happy to be a part of it. And I think for us, we just you know we we got we, we know the team we're playing. We're playing an amazing team. Um, they're the champions, and 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 we just got to be ready. We got to be ready. We, we we won game one. We came out with a lot of you know it was really aggressive you know on defense and. Um, trying to make it tough for for the players, you know, to find open shots. Um, but you know, we we know that it's game one, and and they're gonna come out. They're gonna, they're gonna make adjustments, and 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 we gotta be ready for that. Into the middle, uh, fourth row, Kayla. Pascal, Kayla Gray, TSN. Maybe we can chuck it up to your soccer background, but a lot of speed out there tonight, particularly when you're matching up against Draymond Green. What helped free things up for you? Uh, I think you know, obviously, getting some some easy you know buckets in transition. Um, something that I haven't really been able to do all playoffs, and, and um, I think just being able to run and, and, and getting easy baskets out of the rim, and then, and then from there just just playing, just just, just playing whatever the defense gives me. You know, that's why always I used to I always say um, kind of kind of play off of that, and, and, and whatever is open, just taking them with confidence and and, and, and you know believing in myself. Right side on the aisle, four rows back. Pascal Alexandre Tournier de RDS, tu as connu ton meilleur match des séries avec une performance de 32 points, mais collectivement, de quoi es-tu le plus fier de la performance de ton équipe ce soir? Euh, je pense qu'en en, en défense, on a, on a fait un, un, un bon travail euh, avec les joueurs, les joueurs qu'ils ont et, et essayer de les contenir. Et, et je pense qu'on a, 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 a fait un bon travail et, et on doit continuer comme ça si on veut avoir une chance de gagner euh, tous les soirs. Third Pascal, Paul Antunes, ESPN Brazil. Put it uh, did you guys kind of make a make a concerted effort there to come out really strong in the second half? Because the Warriors have had some like legendary third quarters here. They seem to really take it up a notch, and it seemed like you guys really like uh, kept the metal to the pedal there. Um, I think you know, obviously, it's known that you know they always come out halves and 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 they, they put pressure on you. And and I think we you know we we, we knew that. And 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 I mean, obviously. <laughs> Tonight, tonight was able to stop them, but you know um, we know that it's, it's a point of emphasis, and 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 we know we got to come out of halves. You know, in general, we got we you know we can't have slow starts or, or slow halves. Left hand side in the aisle to Jackie. Uh, Jackie McMullen, ESPN, Pascal. Um, I wonder if you can try to put in perspective for us this incredible trajectory you are on from when you joined the NBA, and wouldn't even take a three pointer to now. Um, having the game, kind of game you had tonight in, on such a big stage? Um, I think, you know, man, it's, it's, it's amazing. It's just, um, it just proves that, you know, if you put the work in, man, and, 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 and it's something that is so cliche most of the time, but, you know, that's, that's the story of my life, just going out there every single night, um, working hard to get to this level, and knowing that, you know, I have so much to learn and I have, you know, so much room to improve and grow. Um, I think that's what makes it fun. And, and for me, just just kind of falling in love with the game and, and wanting to get better and wanting to learn, um, you know, moments like this definitely, you know, shows that, that you know, it's, it's, I'm going to continue to be myself, continue to work hard and, and I have, you know, so much room to, to improve. Right hand side, five rows back on the edge. Olivier Paradis Lemieux, Radio Canada. Uh, Pascal, tu as connu vraiment surtout un excellent troisième quart. Est-ce que tu peux me décrire un peu les, les sensations justement à ce moment quand bon, un peu tout semble être réussi? 
Euh, je pense qu'en ce moment, comme, comme je dis toujours, c'est d'essayer de prendre ce que la défense me donne. Et, et, et quand tu, tu sens que tout, tout, tout entre, ça te donne de, de la confiance, bien sûr. Mais euh, pour moi, c'est juste de, de garder ma, 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 mon tempérament et, et de continuer à jouer, de ne pas, de ne pas jouer trop vite. Euh, je pense que c'est ça l'important pour moi, en fait. Last two questions in the middle, five rows back. Armel Kamdem, samedi sport. Pascal, venant du Cameroun, précisément de Douala, est-ce que tu aurais pu imaginer marquer 32 points en finale de NBA <laughs> Tu es Camerounais Bien sûr. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> l'accent, l'accent. Je... Um, uh, je pense que ça, ça fait vraiment plaisir. Et, et, et pour moi, je ne pouvais pas vraiment imaginer être à, à ce niveau-ci. Um, ça, ça, ça prouve juste que, que le travail, le travail paye. Et, et, et uh, je pense que pour moi, c'est de continuer à être cette personne-là qui, qui, qui prouve à tous les Africains, à tous les Camerounais um, que, que, que c'est possible d'arriver à ce niveau et c'est possible de, 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 de faire des performances comme ça. Donc, uh, pour moi, je continue, je continue à rester, rester calme, mais, mais, mais aussi sachant qu'il uh, y a toute une nation qui me supporte, tout, tout un continent qui est là, qui me regarde. Et ça fait vraiment plaisir. Last question, second row on the left to Mark. Pascal, Mark Schwartz, ESPN. When you were 18 years old, about six years ago, had someone told you that in your very first NBA Finals game, you'd put up 32 points, what would you have said to that person? Uh, I mean, probably that it was crazy. Uh, you know, uh, at that time, I don't even know if I really dreamed of, you know, being at this level. You know, I couldn't even think about this this moment because, you know, it wasn't reachable for me. But um, I think once I, I got to the point where I felt like I had a chance, um, I, I, I put everything, you know, forward and, and, and I just worked really hard. Obviously, with the help of a lot of people, you know, my family, um, um, everyone, you know, the, the Raptors organization, you know, all the guys that I work out with this summer, you know, Rico Hines, um, so many people. We just we just continue to put the work in and, and you know, prepare for, for times like this. You know, I think I, I, when I was 18 years old, I didn't think of it. But, you know, once I got to, to you know, believing that, that it was possible, I put everything that I had to be at this level. You told Doris Burke that this was for your dad. What do you think your dad would think about how far you've come? Um, I think it's a question that I ask myself every single day, and um, I know I wish you know I had I had the answer, and, and and I know you know people always usually tell me that I know he's proud of you, and, and you know I kind of wanted to hear from his mouth, and, and and you know I think it would be really cool, but um, for me like like I always say, man, it's it's it's, it's bigger than basketball, and and every every night that I go out there, um, I have a bigger purpose, and and I, and I play for something bigger than this basketball, and and I think that's what makes it special. Um, that every night I'm out there, you know, no matter the result, no matter how many points I score, you know, I'm, I'm playing for something bigger than myself. Thank you, Pascal. Oh, oh my God.